I heard of Toronto. Remember when Vince Young was there? Was it Vince Carter? Vince Young. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There Tracy, you go. Tracy God, McGrady and yeah. Vince yeah. Young. Yeah. yeah. They were the truth. Oh, yeah. Who was a, who was a little point guard, the light-skinned one? Stoudemire. Ooh. Wait. Damien Stoudemire. Damien Stoudemire. Stoudemire, yeah. Yeah. Oh, damn it. Hey, we need to do an intro for sports. Uh-oh. You're going to have to do it today, buddy. What's going on? How's Are it going? Are we on there? We We've been recording. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. I didn't, I didn't even recording. know. Oh, this shit was just weird. I'll just shoot this shit. That's, that, that, that's what it's going to be about. It's oh, going to be like man. that. What's going on? We're coming at you with our, <laughs> coming at you with our first episode of uh, We Got You. This is Sports Edition. We got our boy Justice with us. Hello, hello, hello. Local shop rat. What's up, man? We got my boy Bradley with us. Yeah. You know, right hand sure. man here to shine. So uh, there's some shit. I'm gonna get straight to it, man, because there's some shit panning out in the, in the NFL. Oh man, what's up with Dak, bro? What do you mean? What's up with him? It's it's. I mean, it's you got to pay the man. He's a quarterback. But he forty wants the mil. Money. Well, I mean, forty million. Where did y'all come up with this forty million dollar deal at? But look, because he did. turned down thirty. So what's next? He wants between thirty four and thirty five. They said. Well, whatever. But that's forty. He's round up. A, we round up around her. We ran. <laughs> I bet you, if you Jerry, you wouldn't round up. Yeah. Whatever. What, what has he done? He what has. Do you mean, what has he done? What? Yo, what he's see, had. Why, the, why, why he, people gotta say that? That's been the best. Te- like that team is talented. Yeah. And he's still mediocre at that with the talented squad. He's still leading him though. He's still the quarterback, and that's what people. But that are looking team goes at. as. I'm Z- not saying we should. That team goes as. Z- I'm not goes. saying that they should give him he forty had 3, million. He had 3,800 yards of passing last year. Yeah, 3,800. Mm-hmm. And lost in the first what? First round? Second. First, second round. Oh, first we had a first round, first round by because we yeah. won our division two year, three years in a row. Two years in a row. Come okay. On, two. Okay. Two. Well, all right, he knows better than that. Yeah. But y'all. I got thought. I got. But y'all get eliminated every first the every game y'all play. Every First team game. does that doesn't go to the Super Bowl. That's true. So there's only two teams. So why teams. are you going to pay a guy $40 so all, million and he doesn't go to the Super Bowl? I mean, Bowl? when a dude like Kirk Cousins gets paid, how much he got paid, why wouldn't Dak get but paid did you, that? But, but, but see, that's what I'm saying. Nobody, but from an owner's standpoint. You can't look at it from the owners because Dak's Why can't you? From an owner's standpoint, if, if you're going to pay somebody, prematurely pay somebody like a Kirk Cousins, wouldn't you say – you don't want to do that shit again, make that mistake again? Yeah. Pay, I'm, pay another player like a Dak. But we have to look that at type every of that single skill. player. What, what, what did Kirk Cousins get? Three years, $85 million or something? Something crazy. All, all guaranteed. It was something all guaranteed. crazy. Yeah, it was all guaranteed, though. And, yes, there was people bitching but about it at that time. Not, but to say that Dak isn't on the shit, he's on the same level as Kirk Cousins and me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Which, yeah. But they have both haven't won anything. But that, but, but wouldn't, you say, a, didn't you say, wouldn't you say they mispaid Kirk Cousins? As oh, opposed yeah. to like, oh yeah, would, would you? I yeah. mean, honestly, I'm not defending. Why you think Washington didn't let that. him go? Yeah, hey, I'm not. They didn't let him go. He went to a different team in free agency because they didn't want to sign him to a long term contract. Yeah, they well, let him go. They let him go. Okay, they, well they, then let they, Dak go. Then I say, look, if I was Dallas, I would let Dak go. Let him play it out. Hold on, no. Let, he's gonna play it out. That's why he asked. He wants more. He's gonna go show that he can be that quarterback this year. Franchise if he goes, tag him. If he goes to the conference championship, they're gonna pay him. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you gotta yeah. pay him. But and if he doesn't, if he doesn't, then they're, 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 the they're, the they're not gonna pay him in the thirty range. I tell you, who's a better but, quarterback than him? Who? And he's a backup right now. No, see, don't even try to say what I was. Tony gonna say. Romo. No, no, Teddy Bridgewater. Exactly. Take Teddy Bridgewater. Teddy Bridgewater is a better Sign quarterback Z. than Dak Prescott. Yeah, because well, no. But if you if you look at Dak, they don't use Dak right. If they ran with him and threw with him, he'd be way better. Mm-hmm. Our offense would be way better in Dallas. <clears throat> but instead, you want to use him as a pocket passer. If you're going to do that, go out and get Bridgewater. But why would you want to run him when you got the the league because r- you can because you got to get the defense years in a row. You got to let or you two have, out of three years. You have to at least give the at least. Oh, I might run it. They don't even do that. <laughs> this ain't college, man. Cam you got Newton guys that would knock your goddamn head off. I know, but you off. don't always have to run. In the pros. It's about keeping the defense honest. If I can do it, why wouldn't I show it sometimes? You said Cam does it, but look how beat up Cam is now. I know, now. but you he don't run as much yards. as Cam. So, Cam so, runs way more. I'm saying at least have designed runs at least three of them, at least three of them a game. Yeah. You don't need just, – just do it once just to make them think. I'll tell you <laughs> who's going to ball out this year, though, is Kyle, Kyler Murray. You think? Mm. Oh, man, I got my, I'm, I'm getting a jersey tomorrow. Kyler Murray stop. jersey. Oh. See? Watch. It better not be his size. He knows his dad. Or <laughs> See, Justice, it not be that Justice extra, over there, I know that his extra dad. Small. I know his dad. I got to buy a job. I bet you got a Lonzo Ball one, too, don't you? I got a big baller brand. <laughs> hey, I got some big baller shoes, though, man. <laughs> See, dog, I nah, knew I'm it. Glad. I didn't know that that time. You, you, know you know he got some big baller. No, he got <laughs> some flip yeah. flops or something. <laughs> hey, so what's, so you, here you are at the table, and you got to sign the check for Dak. No, you don't give him $40 million. Really? 
Do you that, sign the check? It, look, this is how I look at it. Is Do you he, sign the check? Hell nah. no. And because he's not better than the guy that just got $35 million. Who is that? In Seattle. Oh, oh Russell. yeah, Russell was, but yeah, he's a, but all the players saying? are like proven. But, and he has a Super Bowl, but that's what I'm saying though. Is you you have to look at it like that. Are we looking at it like that? If at you look at it like that, but then dude, you, can't you give, give Dak forty million dollars a year for all however many years, three or four years, that kills your franchise. Yeah, right? that that you, you that, can't improve your the NFL because that means you would just line. reset the market if that's what he gets. That's what I'm talking. Then about. that means all the quarterbacks is just going to go higher. Yes. That so, means the defense is going to be doo doo. You got so they you can't got some young you got some young linebackers. Hey, I understand. You got to be like Tom Brady. You that's, do. And that's the reason why he got six championships. Yeah, but that's – I mean, he can do that. He can take that pay cut. You want to know why? His wife makes like $400 million. He, But he still takes a pay <laughs> shit, cut. I, shit. He's just out there playing. <laughs> My wife got me. <laughs> Boo got saying, you. $400 million. Look, if you came from the streets, you ain't taking a pay cut. What do you know about the damn streets? I'm just man? saying. Yeah. He, what streets did you come from? What streets did you come from? You came from hey. the lakefront You had a, ga- a You want to take community. a discount right now if you worked at Sonic. Hey, he lived in a <laughs> hey, he lived in a gated community, a gated uh, community in Lago Vista. A in a gated community. Hey, no, I did not live in no damn gated community in Lago the Vista. The hardest times he had because they had to wait in line 10, 15 minutes to dock their boats. Man, don't it. be worried about me. Put the boats in the water. That. Don't, that. 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 don't be the hard times. Do you know I'm what it's saying. like when your chlorine levels aren't right? <laughs> you know what that pressure is like on the man. Team? Here we go. See, see what I'm talking about. Hey, you know what we discovered this week, Justice? What's that? My boy here is scared of the dark. I'm not scared oh, of the dark. Are you kidding me? Bro, I'm not He scared sleeps of with the light on. Leave, but the, a nightlight? It's not a nightlight. It's light. a lamp. It's a- <laughs> he goes like this. He said his girl woke up and, and cussed him out because the light was on. <laughs> and he goes, he goes, you, he, and so he came in and he was all like, uh, I can sleep if, there, if the lamp's on, the TV's on. I didn't need to sleep. If the fire, if there's a fire going, I here said, all go. that shit is sources of light. Like, yeah. Obviously, you're scared of the dark if, if all you need is light. And it stems down from living in a protected neighborhood. <laughs> that's what it is. Man, here we go. That's a, Fuck both of y'all. Hey, what happened to the trash can in the neighborhood? <laughs> nah, that shit was scary. When I was like See, eight, I had to go, go take look, out the trash. I'm going to tell you, this is where it out there. This is where it and starts. And it was dark around there. You never know what was around there. Yeah. What was that there? That shit was scary. The dark motherfucking shit. <laughs> 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 shit. What? But I'm scared now, running around in a gated community. Bro. The not knowing. Hey, the not knowing. The darkness. The darkness. You never know what's going to come get you. Hey, uh, <laughs> You're young, getting yeah. back on this football. What's up with your boy, uh, AB? Dude, man. did you see his feet? Yeah. Oh, man. He I mean, just damn socks in there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's so much that. His toes and everything. Well, they said that oh, the reason man. it's like that is because he didn't right, wear the right I footwear. know that, but I'm just saying his feet are all fucked up. I mean, b- b- well, besides the frostbite? Yeah, corns, calluses. <laughs> you see all kind of runs? croutons, all kind of shit on his toes. All he does is work out. Who? 24-7. They said that that's why his feet can't get right because he works out too much. No hey, shit. You know how he's bitching about the helmet. Did you know that they the NFL war- like gave him a warning five years that this equipment is going to be dated? Well, they gave him a warning last year. Yeah, but no, they, they told him Tom five Brady. years ago. They told him five years ago that like that equipment is going to be dated and still. Well, they said a helmet's only good for 10 years or something like that. You know they have like 20, 25 helmets that they could pick from? I thought his was only like four or five. No, like in the NFL, like the NFL, they provide like over 20 helmets that they could all pick from. My thing is, who cares about the damn helmet thing? Like, Apparently them. I don't know. Hey. No, the media does. I uh, hate that shit. It's like, the who goat, cares the, about the, the goat damn The goat was on the list. <laughs> I know. But, but, but I'm he, like, they're making a big deal. He said he was willing to walk away from football for that. That Man, was just yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, going to walk away from who that 18 million walk away from a bag? Like Tom Brady said, I'll still be out there on Sunday. Yeah, he said he'll walk away from the bag. Because he doesn't need the NFL. Is that what yeah. he said? Uh, yeah, he no, said he's retired. Hey, guys, he said, no, update. He said he accepted the NFL's ruling in arbitration, yeah. and he's excited to play this season. Yeah. That's what he said, yeah. See? So, yeah. He and now blood. he's on Twitter. He's asking people to find him a 10-year-old version of yeah. that same no, helmet. nine years. Nine years. Yeah, because it has to be within not, 10, 10 years. years. So, so he's he on Twitter a, saying, hey, do you have a 2010 version of this helmet? Get yeah. at me. Yeah, he'll pay money for it. Did you see that he was also doing five hundred dollars shout outs on Twitter? Oh uh, yeah. What do you mean? It's A B. Like you could you could send him five hundred dollars and, and he would get on his Twitter and give you a shout out. What? Yeah, for five hundred dollars. Were people doing it? Yeah, no. like he, he did a shout out for I don't somebody's care. anniversary. Antonio Brown ain't been the same since that gold mustache. He did ever that since, he had in the nah, video. Ever since that gold mustache. In the it's video, like, he had the gold remember mustache. Remember that hit that he took? Was it Burfect? Burf what's his name? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. After that hit, yeah. He ain't been the he, same. <laughs> Dude, what is up with his hair, man? 
His hair looks like shit. Bro, he, no, no, that gold mustache got to go. The gold mustache, Dog. too, but yeah. It looked like somebody got a, a bottle of Clorox and smacked his ass right in the mouth, right? <laughs> hey, so what's that, that gold? Uh, peroxide, I mean. Not, what, what's, that, so what's, what's the deal with the uh, Raiders? They're going to they gonna do something this year? They're going to make some noise? Hell no, man. They're going to suck. Is Marshawn Lynch still with them? No. Hey, what about that? Him. He's not with them anymore. Hey, what about that? Video? I know they were trying to drag him through the, the mud the other day. Another topic, what did you think about old Trump saying Cap deserves a job in the NFL? When did he say that? Yeah, he was on, on Twitter and did it during his, uh, an interview. When? He says if and Cap is good enough, he goes, I got a lot of friends that are owners. And if Cap is good enough, he deserves a job. Because he saw that video of uh, him working out. Working out, yeah. And he said, hey, if he's, he's good enough, he deserves a job. So what, Trump gave him the green light? Gave him the green light, but I think he's trying to get black votes. That's what it is. <laughs> Election is election year coming up. Chris, yeah. what you think, Chris? He's pandering. Like old <laughs> he, Clinton. He's going to wear a FUBU he's, shirt. Yeah, he has hot sauce in his bag. He's going to come out with a FUBU shirt on the next. Is terrible. Yeah. But yeah, he, he, he endorsed Cap. Uh, <laughs> after he said, uh, fire those son of a bitches. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he, I guess he's got a heart. What's going on next? Oh, Ruiz going to the rematch in Saudi Arabia outside. Man, it's, what is it in December? I don't know, but they said uh, that they, 7th, they said that they uh, that Saudi Arabia paid them like a hundred million to have that fight there to host the fight. They paid Ruiz hundred million. No, they're giving Ruiz like ten and the rest to old boy. What? They're giving him ninety million. Yeah. No, would you? Where would you hear that at? That's what I read. The Louis, Ruiz is a champion, but they He's haven't signed off on it. He hasn't signed off on it. He's, he that's better not, not sign off on this shit. He hasn't, on it, yeah. And the destination ain't for sure either. He hasn't signed off on that. That's just what the old promoter uh, announced. But why would you give the champion ten million and the the challenger ninety? I don't mean shit. Sure. He probably he made a better promoter. He probably made like fifty thousand the fight before. <laughs> no, he made more than that. <laughs> and a bucket of chicken or some yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah he, he, he doesn't spend that on a car. You saw that? <laughs> I just saw him with the new car. That, yeah, went all that damn money. Yeah, for shit. I, I don't know. That's that's just kind of off. That you get ten percent of the pot. Somebody gets ninety. Hey, so did you, uh, what's up with the uh, back to this NFL real quick? Because I, I, I am curious about our boy Odell Beckham, Cleveland Browns. Every client that comes in here that's from Cleveland is always like holding their head up. Now, it's, like a Super Bowl. Yeah, like like well, that's mean, it. They're in a tough division. That division is really tough. I mean, who's all you, in that division? It's Baltimore. Cleveland? Okay, Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. Cincinnati. Okay. Cincinnati is the weakest one. I would say. Shit. You think? I mean, Cincinnati is gonna be decent. Did they just lose their damn receiver already? Who? AJ Green. Then Green just tore, yeah, Green? he just tore his shit up. No, he's no, he's not out for the year. Cause who's their coach now? For Cincinnati. Shit, I don't even know. They all change coaches. They fired. What's his name? It's just gonna be hard. Baltimore and Pittsburgh. Those two teams are gonna be. Hard. They're I gonna think be tough. Lamar Jackson's gonna ball out this year for Baltimore. The quarterback. Yeah. I think he's gonna I mean, ball he's out. He's in the now. system again, and yeah. they put weapons around him. Yeah. They put the dude from Brown from Oklahoma. Yep. And they got this other kid named Brooks. That, that's uh. And they got a good AB's, running back. That's yeah, that AB's, AB's cousin. cousin. Yeah. Yeah. Who is the D coordinator? No, the uh, the right receiver for Baltimore, that rookie. This came out from Oklahoma. Marlon Brown, I think that's his name. No, I don't. I forgot his name. He's from Oklahoma. Yeah, but, uh, number five. Yeah, I, 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 is there going to be enough football to go around in what Cleveland? Is, yeah. Hell no, there's not. Man, and they got that dude from fucking uh, from Kansas City. They got Hunt. Hunt, after, but after, he's out. Against, games, and yeah. Hunt is the best player on that team. I bet you. Mm. Hell yeah, that dude's a baller. I don't know about that. They got some people on that team. They got they got a dynamic team. They're gonna be a high drama team. I, I feel like there are a lot of divas they're on gonna, there. Dude, that offense they're gonna run a fast paced offense. Watch, I'm they're telling not, you, they get good. They, dude, they already oh, came out what they were. I gonna, don't think Odell Beckham's a top five receiver in the league. Who's in front of him? The kid from New Orleans. Yeah. Stop. A B. No. A B's in front of him. The kid from New Orleans. Julio Jones in front million, of him. A hundred million. No. Not. Is what? Hopkins? Hopkins is in front of him. Hopkins, That's yeah, three. Hopkins, yeah. A B. You already said A B. Cooper. That's four. Hell no. I know. I'm just curious. I just throwing I, things out. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I don't even think he's the top five, man. Nah. But he's right there. He he's, got all the hype because of that blonde hair yeah, and all the endorsement shit. Yeah. The, the, that the one hand catch, catch. That one catch on the but Cowboys I mean, launched his. He, I, I mean, still he's think good. he's pretty good though. He's good, but there's. I don't know that. I'll take a few other receivers besides him, man. I mean, he's right there though. The kid from Kansas City. The beats his kids. Oh yeah, <laughs> to beat his kids. Yeah, he. <laughs> hey, that kid is he, good, man. Didn't he threaten to beat his kids? He didn't beat he, his kids. He, he beat the girl and the like kid. No, nah, he didn't beat the damn girl. He did girl. not beat the he kids. That shit was a setup. He threatened them. 
It was like Adrian Peterson. She said that he Adrian Peterson you. whipped his kids with the with the with stick. Well, that's how they do it in the South, though. They whip shit out you with a switch. But yeah. hit him you got whooped with a switch, didn't you? I got beat with a tree limb, man. Not a damn switch. <laughs> and you still didn't that's damn tree limb. I used to get hit with an extension cord. Hell, <laughs> man. See, that's that's yeah. yeah. CPS. That, back then, that was just a whooping. <laughs> now you got to call CPS and shit. Yeah, now. there was no numbers to call. Wait, so what did y'all get whipped with? An extension cord. I got. I never got whipped with an extension cord because I wasn't bad like that. Man, yeah, I got. I got, I got whipped with a switch though one time. You, fit in your hand. you had to go pick the damn. switch. What'd you get hit with? Sometimes a hand. It didn't matter. That's it. Something, whatever. I got hit with a stick. I definitely got hit with a switch. Yo, yo, you got hit with y'all. Y'all about got, to feel bad for me if with, I keep going. You ever get a? You ever get hit with a, a water hose? <laughs> See, nah, that's, my that's, grandma hit me in the back. I had my shirt on one time. God, hit me in the back with a water hose. Damn, like, I, wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to cry. I wanted to cry, but like I was stuck. Like, ah, ah, I wouldn't come out. You know, that shit stung me oh, so bad. That little metal piece. Yeah, no, she hit me in my back with a water hose, man. I said, dude, this old school is mean as hell. She from Mexico, man. She mean as hell. That was the Mexican side? Yeah, oh, she hit me with the damn water hose, bro. See, that's messed up, right? Yeah. So she hit yeah. with the water hose now, man. The mom going, the grandma going to prison. <laughs> you know so you have like, Mexican hair. <laughs> so what? I have Mexican hair. Yeah, I got red hair, man. It's red Mexican. Yeah, like Carnello. Like That's like what's up. <laughs> That's what's up. Oh my yeah, God. but nah. Yeah. Been about thirty minutes. <laughs> it's like how long has that been? Eighteen. <laughs> Come on, man. You you ain't a good. Uh, you got to pick it up. You're the middleman. You're supposed to have all the topics, and we we talk on it. <laughs> is that how it goes? Yeah. 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 He got high. He can't yeah. talk. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, oh. he can't be the guy. You can't be the guy on the left. <laughs> I got to be in the middle. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna bring you up could, the topics. You could be right there bringing up topics. <laughs> Your mic works. You should have told me. I would have had a list for us today. We what do y'all think about yeah. the Pan American Games? Those guys kneeling. Did you oh, hear about that's that? right, yeah. The, the fencer and the hammer, hammer thrower, both took one of them took a knee and one of them did the fist. Right. And one of them's a white dude, who the white guy Which kneeled. is really badass. I, you know what? And, and there's a couple of cats in the NFL that are going to continue to kneel. Oh, yeah. dude, that, uh, that, that safety, there was a caps uh, boy. It's so, just good to see other races call out racism. Like if if well, you see two, if you see somebody being rude or racist to some other race and you, and you don't say nothing, it's that, that's the problem. Yeah, because only, when only your race is sticking up for racism, it, it fucking sucks. Well, shit, shit is Especially not going to change until a uh, Tom Brady takes a knee or uh, Drew Brees takes yeah, a knee or some right. shit. Man, you know? I wish. Yeah, yeah it never yeah, happened, but I'm right. saying that's when you, it, it'll pick there up more steam. Play, there are some white players in the league that's but, nailed, but they're third stringers or some shit. You know what I mean? Like just, people you all, never hear of. But at least it's that. Yeah, yeah, I'm with that. I'm just saying yeah. until a big name takes a knee, that's never going to happen. Dak told him to stand up. That's probably why he wants forty. <laughs> Because yeah. he's a yes man. Yeah, I mean, he's a, that's yeah. what you call that, an Uncle that, Tom. That ain't no damn Uncle Tom. Man, that's a damn Uncle a, Tom, did, man. He, did you hear him explain? Do you it know though? what Uncle Tom is? Yes. Did you hear him explain why he why said he that? Why he said that? Because he said we got to move forward. What else are we gonna do? Y'all just gonna keep? Everybody's just gonna keep on doing it unless until unless we get caps to, back in the league. Nothing's gonna change. You, you, that's what you really want. In the end, that's what you really want. You want Cap back in the league? Hell yeah! It isn't. Uh, so that's about taking the knee. The, taking the knee. That thing was is about. He's the one that started it. The whole movement. But that's about police brutality, brutality, and stuff like that, man. I understand that, but you still want him. I mean, it go. You want that guy? He's in been the almost three years out of the league. I know, and he should be back in. Yeah, he should. When a guy named Josh Johnson that's been but on thirteen a guy teams says to stand back, gets up, back and what? What are we gonna do moving forward? The, he's still trying to do stuff. You think he doesn't do anything socially? Man, hell no, he doesn't do nothing for black kids. In, in the Dallas area, how do you know? I, do, I bet, I bet you, I bet you, a hundred dollars. She don't do much for black kids in, in Dallas area. How do you know that? I bet, hey. You bet it. Yes. You hope it. No, I, I bet <laughs> he, he doesn't. Though, when do when do you ever see him do? You it? don't know. Oh, Most people's social on, work, man. you're not gonna see. Only the people are gonna Dak, feel Dak it. That's that what. Dude. That's why. It's, that's why it's good. That's why people do it. It's not so everybody can see. You can't. You don't know. You can't just say that. You don't see. I bet you don't see him down in uh, and and. Mississippi State? No. Because they say that's where he done a lot of his social work. That's where it's all – that's where he does a lot of it. At. Yeah. And so if Cap comes back, does he kneel? Hell yeah. Why stop? I don't think so. They that's, said what that, got, that's what he got paid for, to not kneel when he comes back. No, he didn't get paid for – he no, got he paid got to paid drop for, his lawsuit, man. No, he got paid because uh, he got blackballed. Yeah. Yeah, but it isn't not to kneel. Not they can never come. tell you he not to kneel. He already came on and said he's not going to kneel if he comes back. But they said the he Eagles are probably going to get him. He's not coming back, though. Yeah, he's yeah, not, yeah, not going to come back. Him they and said Ray the Rice. Eagles the other day, they were talking about the, if anybody gets them, it's going to be the Eagles. There was talk about the Eagles. Yeah, they need a backup. Their quarterback's always hurt. Yeah. We were just talking about this. 
Yeah, dude. But he hasn't finished don't the have, damn season. Yeah, they don't have Nick Foles to bail him out this time. Whatchamacallit, I, I just think Cap deserves a job. Oh, There's yeah. a cat that whatchamacallit signed the other day, Josh Johnson. He's been on 13 Bro. went to A&M. teams. Didn't Is Mark Sanchez retire? Huh? Mark, Mark Sanchez, Sanchez think, got butt retired. fumbler? Yeah, yeah. 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 he should have been retired. Gone. Hey, my favorite was Mark Sanchez flinched when Darrell Reeves, when he went out for yeah. the Wildcat and Darrell Reeves made him flinch. All I'm saying is if Nate Peterman has a damn job, Cap should have a job. Cap should have a job. Who in the hell is a Nate Peterman? The dude that threw like five interceptions. In a game or? Yeah. Remember the dude in Buffalo, they got rid of uh, they got rid of uh, Tyrod Taylor. Yeah. And they made him the starting quarterback. Oh, yeah. And then they started him. They were on a playoff run. They started him. And they almost missed the playoffs because of that. Halfway through the season, they know, pulled man. him. Yeah, we'll see. You know, we'll time see. will tell this if if, if who's Cap gonna, gets a job. Who 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 the Cowboys playing in the Super Bowl? Man, they're not even making it to the Y'all damn Super ticket? Bowl. They, they're gonna buy the team's tickets. Nah, you go sit Wait, in the stands we're a few and watch years, it. We're a few a few years away. Once they get these damn contracts, is Zeke out. gonna even come back this year? That's the other problem. Man, would you okay on uh on Zeke? Yeah, Zeke. I think he's gonna come back this year. He wants twenty million. It's a lot of money. That's 60 between two players right there. So then what do you think Cooper's going to ask for? That uh, Thomas from New Orleans set the standard at $20 million a year, right? Yeah. I mean, it really has so to he's depend going on, 25. The, on the need for the team. Well, what do the Cowboys need? They, they need, need a wide receiver. They, for, for, to me, Cooper, man, you need Cooper. Yeah, you do. So you pay Cooper and, and Dak? I mean, I – You can't pay all three. I don't, I don't think – yeah. We'll see. Well, we'll see, man. It's always something with them damn boys. <laughs> America's team, the richest what? The richest team That's in the world? That's how Jerry Jones likes it. He likes a circus. The richest team in the world. They he, just, he, he, he likes a circus. They just got listed. He thrives on that bullshit. That's the and man. all of y'all buy it. You know, every Sunday there's going to be some drama. Yeah, and you know what? You watch it too. And that's not in your team. That's I like why. To, I like to. That is his team. Deep down inside, he has. He yeah, I like to watch but that's Let me tell you a story. Back in the days, man, this is early 90s, uh, about – 90, 91, when the you Cowboys used to the practice day. at St. Ed's. Yes, I was a ball the, boy there. The championship. Here we go. I when was you a ball boy there. <laughs> Jimmy Johnson was the head coach there. I got the job there because my friend Gerald Albritton. How old what do you, you mean the job? I got to a be ball a ball boy. boy. Yes, on the field with him. I got that job because my friend Gerald Albritton, his uncle was Vince Albritton, who was a safety. So we got the job for two years there, man. So I got to see Emmett Smith up close, Alvin Harper, Michael Irvin, all them, and Troy Aikman. The boys. And, and from that day when I was a ball boy – we got cussed out a couple of times by Jimmy Johnson because we were being too slow, <laughs> getting the balls in, in the huddle and this, this, and that. Get but uh, <laughs> from that day, I mean, He's even I still hard on wasn't a Cowboys boys. fan back See, then, man. I was just doing it just that for That didn't make the, you a Cowboys fan? No, no I wasn't, man. See, that's, like, that's like the dark shit. See, the, the no, I mean, they were some of the most arrogant. Just, the Emmett, hate comes. Emmett, Emmett Smith, Michael Irvin, Troy, man, they were some of the most arrogant clowns ever, man. You know what I mean? They, they, they were winning. They were championship boys. They would have practice in the morning. In the afternoon. To the afternoon or to lunchtime almost. They would go to Expose. Yep. Go there, eat lunch, have some drinks, then come back and have the practice in the evening. And then after the evening, Michael Irvin used to have a room over here at the Holiday Inn. You remember the room? Uh, here we 35 go. 35 and <laughs> Scott Lee, 35. Oh, yeah. oh, We're at 35, 35 Google Woodward. Maps before oh, yeah. Google yeah, Maps. Yeah, he used, to have, he used to have a couple rooms there that he would take women over there and shit, man. See, that's oh, what damn, I'm saying. And he would doing. sneak out of the dorms and go over there and lay up for a few hours and then come back. <laughs> yeah. How you damn. know you went over there? Yeah, I, 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 I had you, the inside school. I knew every damn thing. You knew everything? Yes, I did. Well, you're going to give us a scoop. I remember the day when Emmett Smith pulls up in his Lexus. When he signed that contract, he was doing a holdout, and then he gets, the, gets his money, pulls up in Lexus, and all the reporters rush him over there. He's like, I know y'all all better get away back, get away from my damn car. And everybody starts backing up and shit. <laughs> oh, he was, right. Emmett Smith was the biggest dick Stop ever, Stop being a Dallas hater. I'm just saying, You're man. a Dallas hater. You're nah. a damn Lakers hater. You're a fucking – you're all the nah. winners. You're, you're a winner Ka- hater. Kawhi hater. Yeah. What did the Lakers win this year? How much have they not won? Oh, see, that's you. You're a Yankees fan, no, Lakers no, fan, Cowboys fan. No, Atlanta Buffalo. Brave yeah. He's got a Toronto jersey now. Yeah. He you did just, get a Toronto he, jersey, he, he, didn't you? You just bought a Toronto you jersey. You just bought a bro. Toronto jersey. Hey, Kawhi, baby. you talking about dick Kawhi. riding. Kawhi. I like Kawhi. Nah. I can't like Kawhi. He bought that jersey for you originally, yeah. and then he decided he like said he bought himself. the jersey because he said I like Kawhi and Drake. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's gonna cut the shirt together and make and make one. The other six, baby. <laughs> Lice, oh, the Kawhi's not yeah. Lice Oh man. <laughs> Wait, no, I got questions. Oh, here we go. No, go ahead. What's the question? We still got to talk about fantasy. Yeah, I was good. Yeah, fantasy. Oh, fantasy. Yeah. 
Who's y'all's first pick? Fantasy football, first pick. You have. Come back to me last. I take Patrick Mahomes. Man, motherfucker, that's why you're going to lose your fantasy every year. You know, 50 <laughs> touchdowns? Bro, he's not going to get 50 touchdowns. Well, he's going to get 45. Bro, he wasn't even the number one scoring person last year. Who's the number one scoring? No, nah, he was. Oh, there you go. <laughs> but I wouldn't take Patrick Mahomes. I'm not taking a quarterback. First pick? Yes. You crazy. Who are you taking? You are crazy. Who are you taking? How far did you get last year, Bradley? Didn't he make the playoffs? <laughs> oh, I made the playoffs. I always make the playoffs. You lost in the first round like your Cowboys, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And the Texans. You talking about when y'all even make it. If y'all don't lose to Cincinnati. And y'all lose to Cincinnati every year with a backup. No, Remember, he didn't man, lose to no Cincinnati that this year, man. Like Wickenfeld or some dude that nobody even heard of. <laughs> like, oh, Lee, he's still in the league. Y'all lost to him two years ago. <laughs> oh, man. Who's, who's your number one pick? I don't even know. Probably either Saquon. I'll fuck with Saquon. They ain't going to have no – who's going to be their offense there? They got rid of Odell Beckham. Hopefully they don't stack the box and get crazy against New York, but that's going to be the guy. Yeah. Every, a lot of people are saying Christian McCaffrey. That's Shit, true. But I'll take, He's going to get I'll a lot take, of touches. I'll take yeah. Kamara over fucking yeah. – over both them dudes to, to me. Because yeah. you know New Orleans is going to score a lot. Yeah. And he had 80 catches last year. Yeah. So you're going to get a lot of points from him. And uh, they don't have another running back now. It's going to take the touches away from him. Yeah. He's going to get all the touches. I don't play fantasy football. Yeah. That shit takes the, the fun out of football. No, nah, that shit's fun. So Especially when you win. When, when, but it ain't fun when you're watching a damn game that you have, like, no interest <laughs> in. Like, you don't give a shit about the teams but the player in it. Yeah. I just like football. You're gonna, how, many, how many fantasy leagues are you going to be in this year? Just two. How much are they worth? And it gets expensive. Two. Well, one's $200. And then, The winner gets 200 No, hold on. It's $200 to get in. Yeah. In. That means there's $2,400 altogether. Okay. Right. And then we do ten dollar add and drop fees. So right. if you drop a player, it's five dollars. If you add another player, it's five dollars. So it's ten dollars all together. Unless the player's hurt, then we don't do the the add is for free. Right. Uh, but that money adds up. And then you also got if you do trades in our league, it's twenty five dollars per trade per person in the trade. Yeah. Um, seven people have to okay it for any trade to go through in the league. And then at the end of the year, the winner gets sixteen hundred. Second place gets six hundred. Third place gets two hundred. So pretty much you get the, your free, free. Yeah, yeah. The money, place, yeah. the money, the money that uh that you're getting for the add and drops, that shit adds up. And it's fifty percent goes to first place, twenty five percent goes to second place, fifteen percent goes to third place, and then there's a loser bracket. Whoever finishes twelfth in the league has to play has to pay a hundred more dollars to the loser bracket. So there can be so nobody. That's wants a to lot of math. That is a lot, man. man, man keep lot of shit it it man. keeps track by itself. Every single transaction keeps track of it. It you just put a, a number on it. Damn, that's a lot. <laughs> I don't have to do any of that. I got it lost. just tells me what everybody owes at the end. I got lost. It's not all. It's not that much. It's and then what's the other? How much is the Shit, other? One? I mean, two years ago, a dude won thirty eight hundred dollars first place. Oh yeah, that's a lot. Nice. Who are your fantasy bust this year? Who are you? Fantasy who are you bust? staying Le'Veon away from? Bell. No, nah, Le'Veon Bell's going to be the truth. You think so? Watch. Did you see that text message he put out? What did he, he say? He said, "I'm sorry to all my fans that oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm coming out. I'm, man, that's, yeah. he's going hard. Watch." Odell Dude, Beckham. think about it. Who's going to be running back there? He's going to have a bunch of issues, soft tissue injuries, oh, injuries like oh, hamstring, growing. Here we go. Watch and see. Ego. I'm being a hater. Ego. I'm telling you, the dude. Uh, I'm going to say Odell Beckham because I don't think Baker is going to get him the ball. Man, you crazy. They're going to they're gonna be spreading that ball all around. All right. That's what they did at Oklahoma. Yeah. They running that same offense they did they, in Oklahoma. Mm. Say, uh, not St. Louis, but Phoenix is running more of that Oklahoma offense with Kyler Murray there then. Kyler Murray. He might be a bust, I feel like. Kyler Murray's going to ball out, man. No, he's not. Yes, he they is. don't have no line. Brad, yeah, Brad, Brad, who's your bust then? You who's my bust? Who are you not drafting no matter where he lands? Um, Zeke? <laughs> nah, you kind of want to draft Zeke because um, you know he's going to be back. They're going to pay Zeke. <laughs> That's one dude they will pay. Mm. You don't think he's not going to sit out two years? He can't sit out two years. That's what I'm saying. So you know, I mean, he's, he's going to be piss back. Jerry Jones he's going to stay with him. For, they have control chill. of him for really five years. Yeah, because they got him two years of contract and they can franchise him up three times. Which I mean, yeah. it, I highly doubt it. But they did that to Mark Cousins. I mean, not what's his name, Cousins. But yeah. it seems like these Went players. Washington, they franchise him twice. But it's like these players don't. It's like they they don't they don't play by like they're more stern now. Like they're not necessarily going along with that. Like they they'll hold well, they're out. They're not because they're looking at it as or, you it, can trade me, so yeah. why can't I do whatever I want to yeah, do? So you now can do whatever like, you want to do with my so now career. Now they're demanding. But I can't do well, it's whatever getting I like want. The NBA. Yeah, they're demanding trades yeah, now. Yeah, my thing is, I don't want to be here. I'm out. Look, yeah. running backs. I wouldn't sign more than a two-year contract if I was a running back. Going into a running back, if I was a rookie, 
I'll sign a two-year contract. That's all you're going to get. We can't do that if you're I know, a rookie. But they should be able to. Yeah. Because, look, in two years, if I've been balling out for two years, I want a new contract. Yeah. Would, would I'm you, not playing for Yeah, I played million. your contract. Yeah, hell yeah. Would you, if you're but a they run, don't, you can't do anything. Yeah. You you're a, this, if you're a running back, would you want to be a single back or a, or a, would you like to have a lead? I mean – what does that have to do anything with I'm just curious because you said if he was a running back. I'm just curious what type of running back would you see yourself? I mean, it doesn't really matter. I think running back should be able to play any position. I, but I mean, some... right now you wouldn't even have a damn fullback. That that position is obsolete in the league. You're going to be true. back there just with a quarterback and shotgun. Them fullbacks are important now. Shit. <laughs> There ain't no damn fullbacks in the league. All right. They're all gone. There's only like one or two. Nobody even runs that type of offense anymore. Hardly ever. The they're wishbone all, offense yeah, and shit running that. Like Nebraska in the power. power <laughs> no, remember the wing. Nebraska, they had like three. Yeah, the wishbone. Wing T and shit. Man, yeah, that shit's gone. <laughs> the di- everything was dive. <laughs> dive, dive off. That's my like back. sneak move in Madden is the like full back up the middle. They yeah. never see it coming, so you yeah. always get 15 oh, yeah. yards oh, off. Always 15 yards. You got the new Madden? Not yet. Let me know. We need who's to have a Madden tournament over here. Who's 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 on the uh, cover of Madden this year? I don't even know, but Antonio, they were saying Antonio Brown was from last year. That's why he's hurt this year. That's what that's they were it. saying. That's what it is. The curse. Some raggedy ass feet of his. <laughs> he's, he works too much. That motherfucker is busy, like always running. Yeah. Always. But who's my bust? I'm trying to think. I don't really. Oh, Matt Trubisky. Who? Matt Trubisky. Who the hell is that? The quarterback for the Chicago Bears. I know Matt Trubisky. Mitch Trubisky. Whatever, Matt. Matt, Mitch. what the hell? Yeah, like, what the hell? You done made up my name. I knew it was some time. I knew it was Trubisky. Nick, Nick Foles is going to be a bust. No, nah, Nick Foles nah. is going to be a bust, No, he's man. not. Dude. Y'all are tripping. Nick, Nick Foles, Foles could be, be Lake Travis. Bro, stop. That Nick was Foles. high school. He could be Lake, Lake Travis. Travis. Been good. He, he's won some Super Bowls, but not. he didn't have to play the whole season. You know, he's Mc, gonna, when he did play the whole season, he went 16 touchdowns and two interceptions. You know, Nick Foles started his career at Michigan State, right? Bro, he's not going to be a bust. Okay, listen. He, he has a damn good team. State. He has a damn good defense. They got a running back. He's going to be all right. Who's I'm the running back? At the Jaguar. What do you mean for net? Man, you get his fat ass out there and run. Right. He shows up to camp out of shape every Bro, year. Stop. It's only oh. his third year, too. Yeah, he, he, the two years in a row then. He yeah. showed Bro, up. He's out still of a shape. beast. I'll he's, take him. He's gonna be a bust. You take him too. Hell no, nah, man. You wouldn't take I wouldn't. Him? He's a he's a head case, man. Frenette oh is God. a head case. That's what you want in football. You want these he's a damn back. He's <laughs> running into motherfuckers every day. You would be a head case too. They're Name running full one. speed into each other. Yeah, you need a head case. You ain't going to no damn Burnett rocket is, surgeon out there. Burnett, no Burnett is trash, man. That no, no, he's trash. not. Okay. He's doo-doo. Okay. He had a couple good years at LSU. Y'all think he's great. What I has he done it. in the NFL? Man, I'll I tell you, he's done work in the NFL. Huh? He's done work. He's not he, bad. He missed half the season last year and he's half his bad. rookie season. He's all right. I'll still in take him In 32 games, he's probably played 20 of them. I'll still take him over a lot of bats. Nick Paul's going to be a bust. Yeah, he's going to be a bust. No, he's not. All right. Y'all want to put some money on it? Hell yeah. You don't What's pay your damn bets, man. Y'all, no, I do pay my bets. You, you know that. I'm bets. from Lago Vista. We y'all, pay bets. Y'all problems, y'all don't remember <laughs> y'all damn bets. <laughs> y'all, like, we, we bet something no, like that. No, this dude always wants to bet on somebody else's team. Do the ja- okay, okay here's team. the bet. Do the Jaguars make it to the playoffs? No. no. Yeah, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. No, but you never know, though. I don't know that. I can't say that. Because the Jaguars don't – I mean, who's in their division? You got Houston Texans. Texans, trash. Come on. I'm saying the Colts are going to win that division, so y'all ain't got a chance no more. They're Andrew Luck done came back and took over. If he's, if he's going – he hasn't even been practicing it in training camp He doesn't right have to. They know what he can he's do. Injured. That's how weak y'all are. Man, stop. Damn. Okay. Well, how y'all looking? The Jaguars are going to beat y'all this year. No. Okay, you want to put some money on that? What, are they going to beat us once? Yeah. One out of two times. You said they were trash. They are trash. Dog, y'all always lose to the Texans. Y'all always mm-hmm. lose to motherfucking Jaguars. Y'all will lose. Y'all be like, what, 11 and 2, 11 and 4, and then y'all go and fucking lose to Jaguars. They'll throw a Hail Mary every single time. You can look it up. Jaguars always beat y'all. We're even 10 when and 6 suck. this year. 10 and 6, 11 and 5. No, y'all not going 11 and 5. Not in that division. That yeah, division is fucking hard. The Jaguars, the Titans, which they play defense on y'all asses every year. They, don't, they were talking the other day that Mariota might not even start. <laughs> it don't matter. That, what's his name? Tannehill? That came from Miami? Has been out playing him nah, during, during hell some. Nah. Who, who's Miami's That's, quarterback? Dog, Tannehill? Yes. yes. Miami's quarterback is Rosen. Rosen from the Cardinals. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
Damn. They said Tannehill's been playing his ass off this training Man, camp. Man, I can't believe the quarterback that transferred to Miami Hurricanes, he's leaving and he wants to leave again. The Ohio the, State kid? Yeah. Ah, oh, he's a bust. Because, uh, yeah, well, he wants to leave again because he got outplayed, and they're starting that true freshman. Uh, the Jerron, Jerron Williams, yeah. I think that's his name, they're starting him. Well, you know that the, so, the cat that came from Ohio State to Miami, he played at that Gordon Bishop in mm-hmm. Vegas or whatever it is? Gordon, yeah. Gordon Bishop? Yeah, where Snoop Dogg's son. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I mean, he was a stud there. They had like a documentary about him, like him when he was a freshman all the way through his senior year. Yeah, that dude's supposed to be the truth. He was a stud, yeah. They were saying, yeah, he's gonna, he's not gonna play. He's gonna, he wants to leave. He didn't show up to practice two days in a row. No shit. <laughs> yeah. I didn't hear about that. That's crazy. I just, oh, how does it work though? Doesn't he have to sit out a year? No, nah, he was, he was eligible to play right, right away. Oh yeah, because of the new transfer yeah. rule or whatever. Yeah, so he's eligible to play. Mm-hmm. So we'll see. We'll see what my Canes do. We'll see. It's going to be a, a long football season coming up pretty soon. Thankfully, thankfully, football season's coming up. Starting with college. Yo, we're going to have the uh, the LSU game, right? Yep. So we're having a tailgating party here. We're going to do big screen. You going to fire up the pit? We're going to bring the pit. I'm bringing a grill. Man, you're always lying about firing up the damn pit, man. <laughs> we're going to get the strippers, like you said. Okay. See? I yeah. ain't lying about that. <laughs> How you like that? I ain't lying about that, am I? So, Strippers? Uh, yeah, so we're gonna have that LSU Texas game here. So y'all, y'all, this will be out by then. So y'all should definitely come out and kick it with us. And, uh, that wraps up this episode, man. Yeah, we'll see y'all sure. in the next one. We man. out. The Texans suck for real. Y'all yeah, ain't no, no, they really do. Yeah, the Texans are fucking shit. garbage. You know they are. Yeah, we got Deshaun Watson. What does that even mean? That's like that saying we got that. We got Hopkins. We got that. We got Cooper. Who you said you would rather take Hopkins over his deck the other day? Uh, Hopkins is a Watson. I mean, you said you had to take Watson over over Dak the other day. Yeah, about the same. I, I I would like to see him with a badass running back. He probably would be better than Dak. Yeah, with a badass running back and our line, he probably would be next. They got Duke Johnson. Man, stop. Let's just say hypothetical. That's, that's going to be a bust. Let's just say Lamar hypothetical. Miller's better than him. Let's just say hypothetical. Lamar Miller is well, better than say him. Lamar. Hypothetically, hypothetically speaking, Romo came back to the Cowboys right now. Stop. Oh, gingerbread oh, ass quarterback. He always be getting hurt. You're like, oh, I stole my time. That's, that's a that's a contending team. That dude hasn't been the same since he fucking fumbled that damn ball in Seattle. Yeah. The game. first fucking Trash. game. Garbage. That's, you got one job. Catch the goddamn ball and put it down. This motherfucker can't even do hey, that. Hey, when he was running it, running it in, there was nobody in front of him. He <laughs> yeah. saw that damn he golden light. <laughs> and then that dude that shoot string tackle his ass. Oh, oh man. man. Pressure bust the pipe. Yeah. Man. We'll be like, ooh. All of our hopes right there. Yep. All right. Manager. All right, brother. All right, get out of here. Appreciate sure. you.